Hi guys, welcome to CloudyML. My name is Rahul. Today we are going to discuss a Python uh, interview problem which was asked in Adobe company. So the problem statement is given a string as reverse the string without reversing its individual words. Words are separated by dots. So for example, this is the string I have with there are three test cases here. First is I dot like dot this dot program dot very much. So basically I want to reverse this string and I don't want to reverse its individual words basically. So if there is this is the word I like, I don't want to do it on the letter by letter. E K I L. I want to do it word by word. I don't want to do it on the individual level. I don't I want to do it on the whole string level. So uh, I'm taking this string first. I dot like dot this dot program dot very dot much. So what I'm gonna do is first I'm gonna convert this into list. So how I can do that? Let me just show you. For example, if I say s dot split, and since I wanna split it on the dot level here, I will pass dot. So what it gives me? Let me show you first. Uh, I'm gonna do this in a separate cell. I'm gonna show you. If I do this, it gives me a list of the uh, list of this string, and um, I, it will be separated by words. Oh, since I I need to run this also. So after running this, you can see that it is giving me a list of all the words here. So I have done the first part. I have converted it into a list of words. Now I would like to. I would like to say reverse it. This is this is the inbuilt method in the list to reverse the list. So if I apply this, okay. Let's say uh, I do this. I put it in a list of. So you can see that I have the words of this string in a reverse order. Now the main thing is I need output like this much dot very dot program. I don't want output in a list like this. I want it. Uh, I want it in the form of a string again. So what I can do here is let's say I'm copying it here. Since I want I want it in the form of list. There's a method called uh, uh, dot join method. In the in the parenthesis of dot join method, you need to pass a pass an iterable iterable, which is basically a uh, anything you can iterate, basically list, set, dictionary. So since I want to join it, but I want it again, uh, I want to join it by using dot. So I will pass dot in the string here. So if I do this. I will get the necessary output, which is the expected output here. Much dot very dot program dot this dot like dot i. So this is how you will solve this problem. Now let's say uh, I don't want to use this reverse method. So there's another method also. I can simply, I can simply first the same thing. I will split, and then after splitting, let me just copy this. After splitting it, I will use indexing, and I want to reverse it. For example, if you want something from beginning to the end, if you want to split, and I want you want to beginning from the end, you will get it like this. I like this program very much. Now, if I want to reverse it, I will just pass here minus one, and you will see that it will come much very program this like I. Now I've got this reverse. Now again, I will just use a simple method dot join. I will pass it, and I will get the same output I had earlier in the previous cell. See, same output without using reverse. Now, every time if you want to apply this, you need to you need to uh, write a variable and then write this code, which looks really uh, complicated if someone watch it at the beginning and it's hard to understand it and you don't want to write this again and again so you can simply create a function 
reverse string and pass a string here s and now whatever code you wrote this here you just need to copy it and paste it now instead of s just pass s now here your function is ready now every time you just call this function your string will be reversed now uh, first i will i would like to pass the second case this is a simple case let's say that uh, this line now uh, cloudy ml dot provides dot affordable dot courses now i will pass it here now uh, i have passed it now i'm calling this method now here you can see that uh, it's in the reverse order courses dot affordable dot provides dot cloud email this is how uh, you can do this uh, using reverse method without reverse method and then you can uh, create a function which you can just call every time and pass the string and it will do the job for you so so this is this was the problem here i hope you understood it if you would like to know how this reverse uh, method works in the list you can just check its documentation once and uh, if you have any question regarding this you can comment and you will get the reply so i hope you enjoyed this problem statement and uh, before closing the session i would like to tell you about uh, our uh, courses which we provide and uh, it's like uh, the best affordable courses in the market for example this data science combo package you will get uh, access to multiple courses inside this for example uh, ml for data science python for data science sql for data science so you will get the this in combo package so just have a look at it if you uh, like and the best part of this course is you will get the mentorship session every day where you can ask your doubts related to the course and you have all the support provided uh, so i hope you enjoyed this session and if you have any question related to the problem statement or our course you can just simply ask you will get the reply thank you guys